okay? Peaches basically produce fruit on last year's wood in the middle third of the branch. So once you get done thinning and removing all that crossing and dead and broken stuff, and you get the shape that you want, then you want to head back the top third of that branch. Now this peach is just producing fruit everywhere. You know, the tip of the branch is just going crazy. But generally speaking, most peaches are going to produce fruit in the middle third of the branch. That's where the best fruit's going to be, for sure. But this tree is just full of stuff that we don't need. Here's another broken branch. There's just way too much in here. Um, I want really to have um, a lot more spacing in here. And if it all stayed on the tree and ripened, it, it's, none of it's going to be very big. And so it's not going to be that much fun. You know, a couple bites for that much. So why not have a lot less? So let's get rid of... And the thing is, you know, all this growth is taking energy. It's drawing energy from the branches that are producing the best fruit. So why not remove this stuff, get it out of the way, and send the energy to where the tree wants to make the best use of it? You know, to where we can get the fruit that we want. The, the bud immediately below the cut that you make is going to draw the most energy that's coming through that branch. And that's where the longest whip is going to come from. So if this is my branch, and it's growing out here like this, then you need to find the bud that's growing in that direction. So here's the one growing in that direction. So I want to get at least a quarter of an inch above it, not right on top of it, okay? And if you cut on a bit of an angle, one, it's easier to cut, and two, it'll just heal over better, okay? And, you, and certainly, you know, you want to use a sharp tool, okay? So when I'm, when I'm looking at a branch like this, now already there's so much weight on this thing. I don't need this. So I want to, now here I want to get close, but I don't want to damage this little area where the branch is coming out. I want to get close to it, but I don't want to leave like a half inch or quarter inch stub sticking out that's going to die back into the branch. I want to get close so it can heal over. So we've got a big long branch coming out here. Um, don't need all of this. Um, this is kind of weak. We can go like this. And that's about as long as we need to see this thing. Probably too long. Now, I could spend all day on this. Okay.